you can probably see that my um, upper thigh, so from my knee upwards, excuse the hairy legs as well, but I really don't care. Um, yeah, from my knee upwards, you can see particularly around where the surgery where I had the lymph nodes put in is still pretty swollen there um, and pretty sore. But um, it was quite a lot bigger the other day, just after the surgery, like days two and three, because there was a lot of excess liquid, I guess, that's already come from my leg up to the top half of my leg and um, has obviously gone back through my lymphatic system. But yeah, you can see that it's, it's quite a lot bigger up the top still, which is normally not like that. I might just add, it's normally a little bit smaller. Um, but yeah, you can see. You can see the difference already. It's looking great and feeling fantastic. Like, I never be able, was able to do that before. It's incredible. And another thing that I really noticed is um, that I, when I stand up, I don't feel that rush of liquid go to my feet. Like, I don't know if you guys get that, but sort of pins and needles type feeling when you stand up and you have all the liquid that descends into your into your legs and your feet. I used to get that all the time when I'd stand up. So even after elevating for ages, I'd be like, yay, that's great. I've just elevated. I've got a lot of that liquid out of my leg. I'd stand up and I was like, oh, there it goes again. It's all back down there. That was a whole big waste of time. Anyway, there you go. Little update for you guys following the lymph node transfer by Dr. Becker.